I'm going to show you how to make a uh, very simple video intro using Wondershare Filmora. But first what I want to do is just show you some of the ones that I've already created. Okay, so I'm going to show you how to make a video intro. Basically, if you want to make it for YouTube, now this is very, very basic, but you guys will basically be able to build your foundation and build on top of this. Okay, so the first thing I want to do is talk about music and sounds. Okay, so let me just go into YouTube here. And, you know, there are issues that you can have with copyright and stuff like that. I've gotten like a couple issues like that before, like in the past. But if you go to YouTube here, and under create you go under uh, audio library and you can see you can there's a lot of free music here and sound effects okay so basically with any of this stuff you're going to be able to like you're not going to have problems monetizing your youtube videos okay so let me just show you like some examples here let me just click down here there's tons of music that you can download now some of them it's like free but you'll have to like input like this information in your video description okay like I don't care for this I don't want to have to deal with any of that so what I'll do is under attribution here I'm just gonna put um, not required okay so now basically if you want it like this Beethoven under your um, in your intro video it's absolutely free to use okay and you can see the uh, duration 2 minutes and 30 seconds here 23 minutes and 40 seconds we're going to be able to cut it wherever you want okay even and video intros <clears throat> i mean i would recommend something like in between like three to like seven seconds i kind of like to keep mine like short but you'll be able to cut it you know for you know if it's seven second intro you can cut the seven uh, cut out seven seconds anywhere you want in the video or in the uh, the music file and then you can fade in fade out as well okay so and also there's there's tons of uh sounds as well like let's see here you can do like, tons of sound effects on here <clears throat> uh, but let me go into free music here let me just try to pick one and then we're just going to go with that one okay uh, let me double click on this one here or let me play this one okay let's just say that this is a song you wanted I'm gonna go ahead and download this okay and this is one minute and three, 13 seconds so I'm definitely gonna have to cut it Okay, now this is called the uh, face off. So let me go ahead and just copy this into my music uh, folder here. Okay, so now of course the Wondershare Filmora, I mean, they have their own music in here and like other sound effects. The only thing is with the music in there, I'm not sure if it's copyright. I think I used one of their songs before and. Uh, basically, YouTube wouldn't let me monetize that video, but I mean, if I'm wrong, then comment below. Because uh, it, it was a while ago, I, I can't really, really uh, I can't really remember. But okay, so here's the face-off song here. And uh, this computer is really slow, so I got so many things going on this computer right now. Okay, so then let me go ahead and go into music, and under here. Okay, so I called this one face off. Okay, so let me go ahead and just paste this in here. Another thing you can do too is you can start downloading like a bunch of these. Put a whole bunch of clips in here. That's what I that's what I did. But let me go back to my Filmora here and let me go under music and let me just import that one um, song. Okay, import and it was called face off. All right, let me go ahead and open that. Okay, so now, okay, so here's the face off right here. Now let me go ahead and let's go under text and credit first. And I'm just basically going to wing it, okay? I mean, there's so many things that we can do in here. Uh, let's just go, let's, let's look at the openers here. You can see like a lot of cool animations here. Um, I, I'm just going to have to guess one. 
I mean, we can even go into like, I mean, there's so many things that we can do in here. Like really, we can even go into like one of these overlays. We can put an opener, put the overlays like over it. Uh, let me go back under text and credit here and then let me go under opener. And I'm talking a little bit fast because uh, I don't want this video to be uh, too long. But all right, let's just go with this one here. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and use this one here, like the animation here. That's if you want animation. So I'm just going to put that there. Uh, another thing is too, is if you guys have like your own label or like a banner or photos, you can import that too. Okay, I don't have like no um, label or anything like that. I just write everything like in text. Okay, so anyways, here is that animation thing right here. And then I can include text. So let me go ahead and double click on this. And I'm going to put I love trading. And then I put you are all idiots. I'm just putting something up here. Just as a demonstration. Okay, so I got I have this in here now. Now let me go ahead and try to like let me go ahead and move this up here. Let me move this up right here. And then you wanna I'm gonna go ahead and change the font here. I'll change the size here. Let me change the font too. So let me just go to this top part, my channel name, and okay, I'm, I'm just gonna go with that, okay? And then I'll change these. Uh, this text down here and okay let me see let me just just go with something here all right let me just go okay I can't do the same thing uh, all right let me go back to the top here I'm just gonna pick another one no. Okay, I'm just going to go with this here. Right? Now let me go ahead and highlight all this, and then I'm going to center this. And I'm going to make this a little bit smaller down here. Just make it a little bit smaller. And then let me double click on this right here. Let me, let me click on the bold here. All right, and then let me go ahead and just play it real fast. Okay, now let me, and I have the advanced tab too, so let me just go ahead and click on advanced. I'll show you a little bit what you can do in here too. So we can change the colors here. I mean, we can change color fill, gradient, image fill. I mean, you guys just want to go ahead and play in here. We can change the border color. Like, let's go ahead and change the border color on this area right here. And I'm just going to make it. Just make it blue. You can see it's blue right there. Um, you can put like shadows down here as well. Uh, let's see here. Something like maybe like this. You can kind of see that down, and then we can kind of blur that in that bottom shadow part in and out. We'll just make it like that. Okay, that's fine. Uh, of course, we can change the color as well. We can. If you want to move this around, let's make it like red and something. Red and yellow is fine. Okay, so it's like red, then it slowly turns yellow. And of course, you can change all that too when you're, uh, what is it, right here? Uh, I think it's down here. So you can kind of change it. Uh, we'll just leave it just like that. And then what we're going to do is, okay, so I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, See, and this is where you, you can import pictures too, guys, your labels and stuff like that. You can add the image here. You can even put your own text in here too. You can write something on here. Every time you bring something here to, to delete, delete this box, you just have to um, highlight it. See, it's all square. And let's go up here and tap on delete. Oh, the animation. So let me go to animation here. Animate. It, this is really cool. So pretty much if I want something on here, let me... Uh, Hold on a second. So basically, how do I want the text to move? Okay, you can see just double tap all these. Uh, let me go down. How about something like that? 
How about a little swirly thing or this swirly thing here or something like that or this or this. Here, we'll just do this one. This kind of a swirly thing here. Okay, so I'm just going to go with this. And of course, you can play around with this as well. I, I'm just going to leave it at the default. I'm just going to click on OK. I'm going to click on OK here. OK. And let me just go ahead and click on play here. And you can see so far, that's what that looks like. And then let's go ahead and go to music. And another, oh, another thing too is another thing too is you can make your own like background color too. If you go under, uh, there's like sample colors here, right here. And then you can make your own color. And you can change it. <clears throat> you can add like overlays and stuff on there. Anyways, let me just go with the default to that, what I have on here right now. Now let me go under music here. And here's the face off. Okay, perfect. Okay, just let me go ahead and grab this. I'm just gonna bring this down right here. And then I have to find a spot where I like, but I'm just gonna go ahead and I'm I'm winging all of this, okay? So let me just uh okay, that's fine. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go ahead and cut it right here. Okay, of course you can go in the middle or the end or wherever you want um the part of the music from. So let's have see how this looks now. Okay, and one more thing too is if you guys, on one of my intros I have my voice on there, like there's a background noise and I have something like this right here. Let me go and push play. Whoa, oops, son. Welcome to I Love Trading. Okay, let me see how that sounds right now. Welcome to I Love Trading. Okay, perfect. Okay, so what I can do with this one too, I can double click. And this is what I did. I made the pitch like less, so my voice is like a little bit deeper. So now if I press on this. Welcome to I Love Trading. And then I can go ahead and fade in and fade out as well. Let me just go ahead and uh, fade out. Okay, fade in is basically... Uh, when your intro starts, it'll start low, then it'll go higher, then it'll stay in the middle. And the fade out is like, uh, you know, it'll start fade in, it'll start, the volume will rise, and then it'll stay in the middle. And then fade out is as is about to end, it, the volume starts lowering down, okay? So I'll just leave the, the fade out right here. That's probably just perfect. Uh, I'm just going to go with it, okay? So let me go ahead and move this over. Okay, now let, let me just play all this. And... Welcome to I Love Trading. Okay, so let me go ahead and start cutting this now, okay? So I need to... That's what the music end. I, I need to click on this music too, because what I want to do is I want to fade this out as well, okay? So let's see how that sounds now. Welcome to I Love Trading. Okay. Let me click on OK. And of course, like I have tons of other songs in here. And it sounds, what you can do too is you can start bringing all these down to your timeline and start switching them back and forth to get like a better idea of which one that you want. Uh, let's go into overlays here too, okay? Let's, okay, there's tons of overlays here, guys. Tons of them. Here, let's go ahead and throw something else on here. Let me just drag and drop that there. Let me just push play now. Welcome to I Love Trading. Okay, perfect. All right, let me now. I want. I need to go ahead and delete this right here. And what is this part here? Okay, I need to delete that. That's part of the music. Now let me go ahead and this is exactly five seconds, guys. If you look over here. Welcome to I Love Trading. Welcome to I Love Trading. Perfect. And now what you want to do? Okay. Well, so you guys pretty much uh, got the message. Um, you guys will be able to build on top of this as well. If you guys have any questions or anything, comment below. If you guys subscribe, share, like. I appreciate it. So basically, what you do from here, once you have, you know, what you want, and you can just go ahead and export it. Uh, I keep mine as empty or MP4, and I like to keep mine at uh, 80p. But of course, you can make it 4K as you want. And 
put it in the file you want and click on export and that's pretty much it.